What's up, Otaku fam? We are the Otaku Couple, back with more reactions here for the channel with more Dragon Ball Z Abridge. Continue with episode 38. Last episode, they beat up on Dr. Jero some more. Trunk showed up, let him know that they're fighting the wrong pair of androids, to which everybody understandably said, the fuck you mean we're not we're fighting the right androids? Because Trunks didn't think there was going to be more than just the two. <laughs> Little did he know, there is a lot more than two. But we'll get to those later. Thank you guys for the continued support. As always, be sure to comment, like, subscribe. Every little bit helps. The full uncut version in the event that anything happens to these videos due to copyright will be on our Patreon under the $1 support tier. There are other tiers for full uncut versions of our reactions to anime, TV shows, and movies. Check it out if you're interested. Helps us out a lot. Let's hop on in. The following is a non-profit fan oh, <laughs> Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Yep. Please support the official release. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yep. sure it was about to be a wish there. <laughs> it's about to be a wish. <laughs> oh, there you are. Aw, don't worry, Trunky. It was just an explosion. You'll get used to those. Those happen a lot around Mommy. By uh, your choice. I saw somebody else in the car with you. Hmm? Hey, it's a Ruby. What is it, Corin? <laughs> Why don't you go help out the gang? Oh, sure, Corin. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? I gotta rock up my butt. Poor <laughs> <laughs> <Yajiro. laughs> Sparse game. <laughs> You're cute. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> he got away again, and not a nut or bolt to be found. You had any nuts to begin with. Uh -huh. Look, I don't mean to tell you how to be a father, but why didn't you try and save your wife and son? My what and my son? Wait, you mean you two never got married? What is that, some kind of food? <laughs> no, just listen. When two people love each other... Oh, wow, I'm just f***ing with you. My God, who doesn't know what marriage is? Also, love each other? Making a lot of assumptions here. <laughs> so, I thought you guys were fighting androids. I love the idea. So that's a nice little parallel, though, thinking about it, because Goku didn't know what marriage was, because Goku's a simpleton. Mm -hmm. Vegeta was raised around royalty, mm -hmm. where marriage is probably very much a thing. Right. <laughs> that was talked about very early. <laughs> so it's just, just funny, the, the comparisons. Why was Dr. Giro here? <gasps> Who that? Scientist, worked for the Red Ribbon Army, adequate with robotics. Yeah. Oh! Just Mr. Dragon Ball Kensei. stuff, y'all wouldn't know about that. You fing failure! Hold on a second, I you <laughs> told us. Two androids, May 12, 10 a.m. South City. Well, nine miles off of And what happens? We waste our time on the wrong fing androids! Look, I was uh, how old is that baby? About ten months. Ten months old at the time. <laughs> how about next time you come back to give someone a heads up, you give them a goddamn photo! I mean Just he's not listen. wrong. <laughs> traveling back in time may have caused a butterfly effect. The androids that kill you in the future could still appear. I don't give a shit about butterflies. <laughs> With all this time we've wasted, Dr. Giro has probably made it back to his lab already. And God only knows where that is. I know where that is. You do? You do? Why didn't you tell me? Because this never came up before. No, I meant <laughs> in the future. Never mind. How do you know? All scientists know where all <laughs> the scientists' just labs fed are. Up with this Dr. Bullshit. Frapp, Dr. Wheelow. Who? Long story. Last time From I the checked, you're in a secret Dr. lab Wheelow. right outside North City. Well, then it's time <laughs> for round goddamn two. Wait! You can't just take off on your own. Are you giving me orders? No, kind of. I'm trying to help you. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but I don't listen to bastards. <laughs> Damn. Gohan. Yeah? You're a good kid. <laughs> Be no. a good dad, Piccolo, Thanks. after that shit. Yeah, no, Gohan needs to know to he's, he's cared yeah. for. <laughs> that was sad. Wait, dad? Oh, yeah, by the way, that kid's your son. No harm <laughs> telling you now. Damage already done. Oh, wow, <laughs> he grows up to be a cutie. And, oh, my God, I solicited my son for sex. 
You just learned about it. And it is hilarious. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Gohan, I think Bulma and the baby need to go home. Yes. We do? You do. You well, do. Well, it would be nice to check in on my dad. Actually, I kind of need a ride, too. But I... Actually, I'd like you to take me home first. But you... Stop worrying, <laughs> Gohan. I'm sure Goku's fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's doing fine. All right, made a miscalculation. A couple miscalculations. Lost an android and a hand, mm -hmm. and I think my brain case is loose. Ooh. But there's no way they can follow me, and none of them know where to find my lab. Huh? That's funny. They're all flying right toward my. Oh, find me in the Alps! <laughs> no, there's no way they find can me in the Alps! Of my secret lab. Unless they know a scientist, like Wheelo or Frap. Or any of the brief. Shit! There it is. Oh, your father, huh? Yeah, you never talk about Dad. What was he like? He was a loner, had a lot of trouble making friends, mm -hmm. very abrasive. Am I a lot like him? You have his gender. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you know, if you really wanted to help out, you could stop following me around and start searching these mountains. I'm trying to save your life. If you just stop and listen to me... The hell do you care? Oh, come on. We both know I'm your son. And are you as disappointed as I am? Damn, bro. <laughs> That's cold as hell. <laughs> All right, we've got a lot of ground to cover. Please don't say what I think you're going to say. We should probably... Here it comes. ...stick together for safety. Hell oh, yeah. Make our green god in the lookout! I don't know. Probably cover more ground if we split up. You shut your mouth! <laughs> nah, he's got a good point. <laughs> god damn it! <laughs> nah, he's got a point. <laughs> Why am I so scared anyway? There's like a sextillion mountains around here. Chance of me running into him on... <laughs> Jeez! God damn! <laughs> got laid out! Into one. Lucky you. Ta ta. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I really got fucking stomped ah, out. No place like home, and the only person who even got close is currently incapacitated. Hey guys, I found Doctor Jero in his lab. I found Doctor Jero's lab. Inconceivable. <laughs> How are you, Sensu Bean? Sensu Bean. I don't know what I was expecting. Please, if you wouldn't mind waiting for a moment, uh, Tien. <laughs> Tien. I just <laughs> show you. Oh, <laughs> Krillin. Krillin. <laughs> oh crap, it's the androids. No fucking shit, Krillin. <laughs> I really can't believe that worked. We can't either, Dr. I also Shiro. can't believe I may have to resort to 17 and 18. I should measure my choices. I can't be too careful with him. Piccolo, over here! I found your own lab! Ah, oh, my wrist! <laughs> <laughs> The swag. Hello, Dr. Zero. How are you today? Well, that's new. I... I'm just messing with you, man. What's up, Doc? <laughs> oh, there it is. Good morning, Android 17. Man, according to my database, it's been a while since you last turned us off. You mean since you tried to destroy me? Yeah, Doc. And I'm real broken up about that. It's just every time you talked, all I heard was, Kill me, kill me, kill me. <laughs> Something with my auditory. I think it's gone now, though. Mm -hmm. Well, suppose you just needed to be turned off and on again. Hmm. How about that? Yeah, how about you gonna that? You going to wake my sister up, too? Indeed. I require both of your assistance. Wow. Must have gotten yourself in some shit. Here, let me get on this. Ah, now my wrist! <laughs> you fucking idiots. <laughs> it's Bay Team! Hello, Dr. Jero. How are I already did it. Ugh, you dick! We were supposed to do that together! I know, but I couldn't help myself. Whatever. What do you want? Well, Son <laughs> Goku's comrades are currently knocking at our door! Ah, my other wrist! Jesus 
Jesus, use your shoulder! <laughs> Incident earlier today, I lost Android 19 and my own. Wait a sec. You built another Android? Wait, wait, wait. Was it that fat clown thing? <laughs> I thought that was a joke. Well, clearly it was. It's dead. Ooh. And so are we if you don't. Whoa, slow down. Are you an Android? Holy shit, you're an android. How did you even do that? I took my brain out and put it into this body. How? I... Uh-huh. Huh. How did I do that? <laughs> we can only assume just he made a robot to do that model. for him. So, we having a party? <laughs> Must be, because you're late. Only because of this brat's constant back chat. Because you flew 200 miles past North City. And I'm about to put my hand 200 miles upside your head. That doesn't make any Jesus, they're loud. <laughs> Great, and now Vegeta's here. 17, 18, you two are charged with eliminating them. You know, I'll get right on that. But first we gotta talk about these trust issues, because I get this strange feeling that after we kill them, you're just gonna turn us off again. And I don't even know how. Why, with this remote, of course. Oh, you mean this remote? No, uh, but you see, that's just the decoy remote. Oh. I wouldn't show you the real thing. <laughs> right, no, no. But, uh, Why would I you ever? that remote back. It was my mother's. Oh, don't you worry. I'm gonna hold on to it real tight. Whoops. Oh. Did your hand just malfunction, bro? Think it did, sis. <laughs> the sass is real. Standing around. No, we can't do this without Goku. Why? It's a goddamn door. <laughs> That's not what I... <laughs> That was the simple solution the entire time. All right, so where are the real androids? That's them. Wow, you are just the grand central station of disappointment, aren't you? <laughs> Damn. How are these people friends with you? Making a lot of facts, facts. Right <laughs> wow. Making you a, got a lot whole of hot mess of these guys over here. And you need to get rid of them. I don't know. We might need some help. Oh, what's this? Your secret project? No, he's in the base. I mean, yes. <laughs> he's in the basement <laughs> talking about cell. <laughs> Wait a second. Did you build a ginger android? Man, there's a soulless machine joke there, but that's beneath me. Wait, what? So I'm pretty sure that's three androids you've missed. Do I hear four? No, 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 no. <laughs> Do not activate Android 16. He's not properly programmed. Oh, and how many of us are? Howdy, folks. I'm Android 13. Look at my trucker hat. I was going through a phase. <laughs> well, let's Android say 13 we open was Southern. Get to know our new friend. Don't you dare! I am your master, and you will do what I say. I don't I, think you like I'm that. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? I think the ear thing's back. I said, I am your master. Oh, he's here to just kill me. <laughs> sorry, oh. Doc. Mm. He said the ear thing just was back. Orders. He's just following orders. So, could one of you possibly spare one of those sentient <laughs> I don't think a sense of beam was going to help that. Mm -mm. <laughs> Bulma, are you sure it's safe to hold the baby like that while we're flying? Well, what do you expect me to do? Give him to Yajirobe? I'm afraid he'll either drop him or eat him out of spite. I am pissed and hungry. She is right to fear me. <laughs> <laughs> I am pissed and hungry. She is right to fear me. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, at least he's honest about it. Yeah. Oh, poor Trunks. Yeah. Just gotta have Vegeta as dad. Yeah. <laughs> Gohan's not much better off, though. At least he's got Piccolo, though. Yeah. Trunks has no problem. Gohan, <laughs> you're a good kid. <laughs> oh. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. And it's a little late. The, the trauma's already set in for Gohan. Yeah. He's been dealing with it since he was four. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, it's really... But at least Piccolo keeps coming back to save him. Yes. Because Gohan can't dodge. Correct. So He really can't. He does save him. He's just trying to teach him how to be better. Yeah. 
And I just do love the whole idea that there's like 50 million androids that Trunks didn't know existed because they never had to even be activated in his timeline to kill the Sea Fighters. Yeah. But I love the multiverse story where Trunks actually goes back in time, goes and finds Android 16. It's like, you see how powerful I am? I will whoop your ass unless you help me out. And he's like, I cool. So 16's a good guy automatically now you because he can't be beaten. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's dope. Poor Makes Trunks. sense. Poor Trunks. Yeah, just wait till we do the history of Trunks special and we really can feel bad for Trunks. Thank you guys for the continued support. We will see you for the next video. Bye. Bye.